And what's up guys? Welcome to Mr. Week channel. Here I am for an amazing supercar weekend here at Bewley. Ariel Item, an awesome car, actually is built here in the United Kingdom and it's going to be a good day out. Here I am now in front of the National Motor Museum and by the statue of Mr. Edward II de Baron. Anyway, I want to give you some facts and figures, guys, actually what we're going to see here, because actually this supercar weekend is one of the biggest in the country, actually. Here just is a staggering and a big number. It's 900 supercars here. So the highlights here, they're going to have prestige, hypercar display on Palace, house lawns. We'll go there. We got the SUV secret garden. Secret. I don't know if I can find that. Can be a big challenge for me, guys. And uh, we got demonstration runs, supercar sounds off, sporting bears raffle, and sports and performance display. There's the biggest clubs in the country here, like the Lamborghini, the Ferrari, the McLaren, the Dodge, the Aston Martin, the Ford GT enthusiasts on the NSX on his clubs, and etc. And I want to share how beautiful and amazing is this supercar weekend. Stay tuned. This is something I'm really interested in because I was a big fan of the of the Top Gear. I'm still not on the new series. But let's start here with a, an ice cream van. Isn't this amazing and beautiful? He's got the mister. I would remove the nippy. Jeremy Clarkson used. He's been here now a good couple of years. As you can see, it's full of rust here and there, but he's still stunning. Look at that, they put the pair of Wellington so the water doesn't go through the exhaust. This was back 2006. Amazing, mini, and why not? <laughs> Look at that, he suffers so much. This car that is full of tape, my goodness. But it's still cool actually, that way. Look at that, they didn't cover actually. The top has got a hole, so it rains inside. It must be rusty everywhere. And there's another that they use on a Top Gear. Isn't this cool? If you are a, a big fan of Top Gear, you can come here and enjoy the cars they use on a the Top Gear. Here's my new friends, I just met here at Top Gear. They are a big fan of the cars as well. Jane May did use it. Isn't this cool? It's like it was built by uh, my neighbors in a, in a big shed. But this is cool, don't take me wrong, this is really cool. Look at this car, beautiful. They still preserve them. This is a Toyota pickup, it's one of the most popular actually. Remember, this car was on the top of the building and the building was demolished. He was under the water in France and he still work after an hour or two. It's another car. And look at this guy, some of the doors actually, they're using some of the cars. Vietnam Challenge, it was incredible. Look at that, isn't that cute? How oh, they modified them so they'd be, they would be able to be in the water. I do remember this one, he got flooded with uh, Jeremy Clarkson. Look at that. Very powerful engine in the back with Jeremy Clarkson. Oh, this is fantastic. If you're a big fan, my goodness, look at that all, look at that all. It's from a 2007 series as well. Really cool vehicles, how they modify them. <laughs> Do you remember that one? Actually, Jeremy Clarkson was inside and went to the BBC office. How they modify these things. Look at that, the mobility scooters here, they modify them, <laughs> they put even a racing bucket seat that is fantastic so this is from 2012 James May there remember the the races they did with his cars this is awesome and that's why Top Gear today is famous because of these vehicles this is cool look at that he could sleep inside do you remember this vehicle look at that pulled by a, a Jaguar this is incredible. TGV12, because the car is a 12 cylinder. Here's the Porsche. Look what it did. Uh, this one actually was used back in 2017 as a Maserati that I found them really gorgeous in left and drive actually. Look at this American car. They did this back 2017 in Cuba. They got a chica, a chica, a chica there. <laughs> Look at this Rolls Royce, they destroy them. What they have done to this car, poor thing. Look at this Subaru pickup. Hello, Mr. Wig. 
Mr. Wig, Mr. Steve. This is one of my favourite cars actually. They made Jeremy Clarkson actually had to drive in London. If this is huge, actually the car did break at some point. I don't know where it was, but it did crack and the frame broke. Because I'm a bad person, they put me in last place. I don't know why, so I will enjoy it. I'm in this tiny train that it takes me around. It gives you a good view, actually, where you are. This train will go through the museum. Hopefully, you can see it well, guys. Look at the supercars there. At the bottom, as you can see, is of the car museum. As you can see the cars at the bottom, this is really cool guys, really cool, phenomenal, this is incredible, lots of things even for children to play. Look at those Formula One cars from the 90s, awesome museum. So there's a lot of things for you to enjoy there, cars even from Le Mans, there's a children's play, look how beautiful is that guys, they, they invest a lot of money on that children's play area. A greenhouse there. Yeah, there's what is that? A deer and a bear. Everyone, there's the palace to visit here as well. Look at that, they plant stuff here, vegetables, potatoes. Maybe they got even fruit here, flowers, plants, you name it. Look at that, the supercars there. We're going to stop and there you go, the station, the Bully. Look at this, old fashioned bus. <laughs> My goodness, this is so cute and beautiful. Look how big is that thing. Isn't that incredible? Amazing cars here, the Radical. The new one is completely different. This is a very fast car. The Ultima in blue, gorgeous car. Look the scoop just above the, the roof. So it takes the fresh air into the engine that is in the back. Normally they do use uh, uh, the American engines on this car. My goodness, these cars, they are fast, let me to tell you. Beautiful. Got a GT40 here. Nice colors. Nice color. I never saw actually one like that. As you can see, there's another one there. That is the, the one similar to the race to the 24-hour Le Mans. But beautiful, they are gorgeous. My goodness, it's got even perplex windows. GT69. They are McLaren, the 675LT, beautiful, I haven't seen one in this color. It's been wrapped in green, but it's not shiny. It's got lots of carbon parts. This is huge and beautiful. And look at that guy, he's revving. Wow. Skyline R35 GTR, what a nice touch. You paint the wheels with the same color of the car. You know, that's beautiful. The 410, my goodness. Isn't this thing beautiful and fast? It's another Lotus, but this is in black. Cool cars, I love these cars. And the Lotus, but this is in turquoise or turquoise. I love this car. Even this car is newer than that one. I would choose actually this one, so it's narrower and it's lower than, than the, the new one. I would still prefer this car. The R35, this is the newest mode version. This is really fast and beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous in white? Beautiful. What a nice touch here above the front fenders of the car made out of carbon. Tesla. I do love these cars. Beautiful. It's not a supercar, but it can become a supercar, and you never know. Cool car, and I love that. C-Class AMG wrapped in chameleon, I call them. And this Guys, it always confuses me. I don't know what to tell you guys. I don't know if this car is purple, blue, brown, green, whatever. Noble. This is beautiful. Really gorgeous car, isn't it? Noble here, two for one. What a gorgeous color, this light blue. Beautiful, this car. This Ferrari, absolutely incredible. It's the new Ferrari. Ferrari Pista here. 720 brake horsepower. What a nice detail with the air scoop on the side look at those brakes isn't that huge guys the jaguar beautiful nice touch this is the the cabrio really beautiful a lot of a carbon from the front lip spoiler some parts of the where it says jaguar there the 
side skirt Gaudier Porsche 997, beautiful 2018. There's the Jaguar, the Project 8. This is the first time actually I came across one. Beautiful, look how big is those side skirts. This car actually is very fast. That is missing in a stripe there on the left hand side. It just came off. There's the little Jaguar inside the car. Here we got here a Nissan 370, beautiful in green. What a fantastic color. Lots of carbon parts actually they mix together with the color of the car himself. The Lotus, beautiful, gorgeous this car. This is not a supercar, but it can keep actually with a supercar on a track. This car actually would be very fast. Beautiful Pista, beautiful. This is the normal one in black. That is beautiful, rather than be just black. And why not? It complements the black wheels with the red caliper. DBS, you can see how beautiful is this car. Look at the craftsmanship of that torsion bar. So the car is rigid on the corners. Nice, not to see just always in red, red, red. Beautiful, 2019, but not only this is a V12, this is a 6.5 engine. So some of the Ferraris, they don't want to be red, this Porsche is red, and it's a cool car. V8 is the new Aston Martin. DBS, really gorgeous, in grey, beautiful. The Mercedes A45 AMG, what a cool car. It's a beautiful. Porsche in turquoise 997. Nice, gorgeous this car. Love the color. For me, it's a supercar and it's a fantastic car. Look how big is those brakes with the yellow calipers. So, yes, this car is not the most powerful here in this car park, as you can see. But I will tell you on the track, actually, this car would be the fastest. Be another Aston Martin. It's really gorgeous. I just love these cars. Porsche here, turbo. Beautiful. Look how big is those brakes, guys, as you can see from the wheel. Actually, the, the, the brakes, they are as big as my wheels in my Renault Laguna. What a fantastic car. And this is the convertible, is even better. The Porsche here, the GTS, beautiful in red. Nice. Beautiful. Lotus, but in red. And this is the convertible one. With this weather, that's what you want to be, as an enjoy. What a nice touch with the Italian flag in the mirrors. What a nice touch. Look at that. The brakes, they are not too big, but this car, because it's so small and so light, it will brake faster. And Aston Martin, what a cool car. Aluminium on the side of the car. Beautiful and gorgeous. Look at the shape and beauty. Look at James Bond. He would be happy to have that car in his garage, and I would love to have to. This is beautiful Aston Martin as well. What a nice touch with the green wrap all the way around the car. It's just beautiful, this car. The only downside with these cars is as soon as you wash, after five minutes, will be full of dust. We got here a Porsche GTS, what a cool car. Gorgeous car, love it. Barcos, I'm a big fan. I never saw actually one on the road, I can tell you guys. So people, these people, they have them, they keep in the garage and they bring them to a nice show like this one. Is the area where people they can eat. There's some caravans selling food and drinks. It reminds me the the Dodge Vipers actually. This car, this is the convertible. What a beautiful car! A, a Piper. This is the phase two. This car is so rare. That is the first time that I came across. This is gorgeous car. Got here, Marcus in blue convertible. So I love these colors. What a gorgeous car. V8. That's what they have. It's a good looking car. Don't get me wrong. And I love that. It's in blue. And how beautiful is that? Really incredible. Mustang in the green. Really cool car. This is one of the best selling cars if you want to know. Look at that, you can have the Aston Martin. The DB4 and DB5. Look at the SLS. And the Mini. And there you go, you can eat something here, you can relax. A Dodge Viper GTS. This is one of my favorite cars. Would love to have one of them. Look at that, it's got nice graphics. Beautiful. And the SRT is a cool car as well, and I do like it. I don't dislike it. I would prefer to have that one if it is older than the newish. I love is the exhausts. All of them, they come on the side. Well, another Viper, beautiful and gorgeous. I love them all. I love them all. Even if I think I, I, I had one of those, I would put a spoiler in the back. So you could have lots of downforce. So I, my car could be really fast. What a stunning and beautiful Dodge Viper in blue. 
with two white stripes in it. This is cool. Another Viper here, beautiful. Another SRT, 10 cylinder, guys. You need to buy a petrol station. Let me to tell you, if you want this car, you need to buy a petrol station because these cars, they do drink a lot of uh, petrol with a nice detail. Look at the interior made out in brown. What a classic car, beautiful. A car from the 90s, but it's still so gorgeous. Beautiful, this car, absolutely stunning. Love this car. Oh, it's my new friend here that I met. A supercar, a Bully. I mean, this is my favorite car ever. If God would tell me, Mr. Wig, what car do you want? Just choose one. I would say the F40. No doubt, no hypercar. Actually, this for me was a hypercar from the 80s and the beginnings of 90s. This car is beautiful from any angle. Look at that, the number plate, they're 40. What a nice touch with the triple exhaust there. And actually you could see through the paint, you could see actually the carbon slightly, if you would look close. Beautiful and gorgeous car. 10 out of 10. Look at this LaFerrari. Really stunning. Out of this world, isn't it, guys? Beautiful in blue, actually. Look at those mirrors, guys. The Miura, beautiful one of my favorite cars as well. If I could afford, but you can't because they are very expensive. Tell you need big, deep pockets to maintain this car. Back 1992, the Jaguar XJ220. Beautiful, this car is big, powerful and beautiful. It doesn't have the shape of the F40 or some supercars, but it's still a supercar. GT40, iconic car, one Le Mans. Back 1966, in three years in a row. BMW, really gorgeous. I can call them actually a supercar from the 80s. That. Beautiful car. Look at this Bentley, guys. This is awesome, beautiful, immaculate. 10 out of 10 for this classic car, beautiful. My goodness, it's five meters long. This is stunning. Can I have one, please? really cool and I love in that color as well the Aventador in green they have stopped making them now there's a Porsche 964 convertible 1994 beautiful in blue what a gorgeous car you got here this beautiful Ferrari 330 my goodness this is so beautiful absolutely incredible I have found even two F40s in one place nice number plate I just can't stop look this is my favorite car ever f40 the ferrari if you want to know guys look how beautiful is this pantera this is beautiful look how wide is those tires guys 300 plus and guys why not finish here by the my favorite car the f40 actually there's two as you can see there's another f40 there unbelievable show 900 plus supercars here, some hypercars as well. Hope you enjoy us as we are just opposite to the main house. If you can't come here or if you live abroad, uh, perhaps I will make even part one and part two so you can enjoy and I can show you more amazing cars to all of you. So thanks for watching guys. Really appreciate and hope you are okay. And I'll see you on the next one.